A curriculum should be dynamic, says Dharmendra Pradhan. Good afternoon and a warm welcome. You're watching Education News Network, where we get you the latest developments in education at the top of the sun. This is Nitya reporting from ENN and the Daily Stories are Amidst widespread protests against the government's Agnipath scheme, Union Education and Skill Development Minister Dharmendra Pradhan has said that Agni Veers will form a highly trained precious community for the country. Addressing the controversy over rationalization of school syllabus, Pradhan said that a curriculum should be dynamic. He said that DU and Jamia Millia Islamia are doing excellent work and global rankings are not the sole indicator of quality institutions. NCERT is the government's intellectual think tank with strong history, heritage and it has competent people. Such debate and discussions regarding the curriculum is not happening for the first time. No curriculum is static and priorities change with time, he said. He further said that due to the pandemic, not only NCERT but almost all states have reshuffled the syllabus and rationalized it based on their priorities. Therefore, this should not be looked through ideological lenses. Unlike earlier, when armed force needed a lot of manpower, today's warfare is technologically driven. Pradhan believes we need to make our armed forces young and committed and we need to create a big base. Agnipath is making the base big, which is why 75 is to 25 is being envisaged after four years. Till then, they will be a part of the armed forces. As far as exit is concerned, if they have joined at the age of 17 or 18 after completing class 10, they will automatically come out as a higher secondary pass student. Also, the entry-level training and on-job training of the Agnivirs can be converted to credit points like in general education. They will be mapped under credit framework and lead to degree equivalence. So a class 12 pass student in these four years can come out with a degree. So when they come out, they'll have a skilled certificate, a degree and a service fund. That's all for today. Thank you for watching Education News Network. For more such videos, do log on to our website, theenn.com. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. Signing off, this is Nitya.